Hey, my name is Phil from FunnelScene.com. In today's video, I'm going to show you step-by-step -step how to set up the Go High Level Chat widget into a WordPress website. This is a very simple process and only takes a few minutes to get done. So make sure you follow along until the end to get the most value. Now, just before I get into it, if you are new to the channel, make sure you hit subscribe. I've got the most amazing marketing tutorials for you. And if you haven't yet got Go High Level, I've also got the 30-day bonus trial. I also have a bonus training course which i'm about to start selling i'll give that to you for free it's got everything you need to know about go high level so make sure you check that out but let's go ahead let's get started and let's install the go high level chat widget okay let's go ahead and get into it what we first need to have is a wordpress website where we want to install the go high level chat widget we need to have admin access to that so we can get into the actual dashboard and add in a plugin we're also going to need to have access to the agency account inside of go high level so we can get the api key so they can actually integrate between platforms and then we need to have access to the sub account so you should have all of these before you get into it if you haven't yet got access to those maybe pause the video go ahead and log in and then we can start moving forward so the first thing we want to do is come to your go high level sub account this is where we can actually edit it i've always found it easier to edit the chat widget first and then install it to the website i notice if you change some things inside of here if you're using the code you've actually got to re-add the code so this just is a workaround for that they may have fixed it since but i've always just found it better to first of all edit the chat widget so what you can do is just have an intro message you can also have for returning visitors another message and then there is some other things like customization like what fields you want intro questions and things like that but i'm not going to get into it too much in this tutorial you can of course play around with it by yourself but what you do want to do is make sure it is enabled so make sure this is turned on and then go ahead and click on save so this is now complete now what we want to do is click on this get it for wordpress uh, button which is going to take us to the lead connector plugin inside of the wordpress store now we're not going to install it here but what i wanted to do is show you the name so you know exactly what you're looking for when we add the plugin in so now that we have edited our chat widget what we want to do is actually come to our wordpress website so come to the dashboard inside of your wordpress website come down to plugins and click on add new now like before we're going to be looking for the lead connector plugin that's why i mentioned it so go ahead type in lead connector and go ahead and press enter and as you can see it's the first option there so go ahead click install now and you can see it's had 20,000 installations five star reviews so there's nothing wrong with it go ahead click on activate okay and now the lead connector plugin is going to be added and on the left you will now see we have a lead connector tab so go ahead click on that tab and now we are asked to get our api key now the secret between here where a lot of people trip up on is you'll find the api key under location level settings company name okay so that sounds confusing let me just show you the easy way to do it so come to your go high level account come down to settings okay this is in the agency view come down to api keys right and down here under the sub account that you want to use we have got the api key super simple go ahead click this little button which is the copy button so once you click it it's going to be copied to your um to your clipboard and then go ahead paste it in here like so right and then go click on save right simple as that now we have integrated the wordpress website with the go high level account now what we need to do is go ahead click on enable chat widget go pull and save right and then if you want you can click save again but we're actually good to go now in theory this new chat widget should actually start working but a lot of people optimize their website and we're going to run into a problem so first of all if you go ahead open your website now in a new tab let's go and see if it actually appears so wait a few seconds nothing's there don't worry it's not the end of the world what's actually happening is you have a caching plugin probably which needs the cache to be cleared so in my case i use lightspeed cache so i'm going to go ahead and purge all of my cache inside of my platform whichever tool you're using you're probably going to have to do it inside of um, that tool specifically but if i go and reload this page now what you will see 
is here we go, we now have our chat widget ready to rock and roll. If you click on it, you can see it now works. Okay, and there you have it in just probably a minute's worth of work, you've activated your Go High Level Chat widget onto your WordPress website and everything should be working nice and easily. If you are slipping up on any issues on it not actually loading, it is going to be probably a caching issue. So whatever you're using to speed up your website, play around with those settings and no doubt you'll be able to figure it out. Now, if you did enjoy this video and you like these step-by-step -step sort of tutorials, once again, make sure you hit that subscribe button and hit like if you did get value from this video. But that's it. If you want some bonus training, I've also got a ton of resources down in the description. But my name is Phil, this is Funnel Scene, and I look forward to seeing you on the next video.